I'm writing the thing they want me to write a form and I'm So gone. about what year is this picture taken? That's going to be early. That's 66, 67. Because uh, we had the white wheels on it then. Yeah. Later on, it was... So you did an awesome job restoring it back to... Well, we've had a... It looks like it did, but everything raceway is yeah. modern. Oh, yeah, definitely, yeah. But, uh, it was a 2-4 straight drive car. It was a rusty old car, that's the way it looked, had holes in it. That's cool. oh. This is a thing from Suffolk back in the day. And, yep, it was fine here. 56 racing a 55 Pontiac? I'm not 50, sure. 55, 56, probably something wagon, boat wagon. still see the lettering on it. You can so. see the rust. Yep. Got it. And the lettering on the tailgate and the quarter panel. Yep. And the grandchild going, Grandpa is crazy. Oh, yeah. Stuart Matthews, which is still alive, still does, you know, work on engines today. Jerry Stahl, who just passed away, who helped us a lot. He's out of Virginia, too? Jerry Stahl's out of Pennsylvania. He okay. did the Stahl headers. Oh, okay. Yeah, I see a lot of cars with them on there. The and, uh, yeah. They were big on junior stock cars back in the day. There it was after we started cleaning, stripping the body, and coming kind of here. soda blasting it. Yeah, and uh, 
Nice. White Mechanicsville, Virginia. Yeah. Come up Not here to race. And uh, we, we raced up here many a day with Bill Carnes on the track back in the oh, day. He owned the racetrack up here. And he was, we were kids. Well, I was in college. My brother was in high school. Jeez. We come up here and he said, well, 